By default, I had a friend that was in the industry. Uh, I got in on the marketing side of it, was never really intending to be a loan officer. And here I am 16 years later. So by default is how I got into it. What motivates me really is making a difference in people's lives and creating relationships. Um, it, it's more than just, it's always more than just the transaction. So it's establishing that rapport and friendship that guarantees them coming back to you over the years. My digital mentor, Hard to say, really. I would probably say Kristen Crowley. Um, she is a, a a wizard with Instagram. So that's probably who I would say is my digital mentor. Top marketing trick is tough for me because I don't have one. I think top marketing tricks is to be diversified and use streams of social media as well as conventional forms of marketing to people like just picking up the phone. So I think it's diversification. And if you just do social media, you're kind of shooting yourself in the foot because not everybody likes social media. Some people actually hate social media. So, you know, if you're not sending letters or postcards or note cards or calling people, I, yeah, you're just, you're missing the boat. So. It's a bit of everything. I think my on job experiences that have made me proud are really when I receive feedback from my clients about how good of a job that I've done. And, and it's an ongoing thing. It's just that instant gratification of knowing that I'm doing the right thing and I'm on the right track. So that's kind of what gives me my kicks. Oh, somewhere where there's white sand, a beach and clothing is optional. That's where I would go for my ideal vacation. My most treasured possession right now, and it changes over time, but it is my book that I have just written. So I've just written and illustrated a children's book, which I am extremely proud of. So that's my most prized possession right now. The most interesting person I've ever met is probably a uh, Holocaust survivor that I was fortunate enough to meet and have a conversation with. And I, I just am generally drawn to people that are older, that have lived life, that have had these colorful experiences that can kind of share them with you. So I don't really care about the rich and famous. I'm more about people that have had real life experiences. If I was not a mortgage banker, I would be a rock star and I would be so good at it. So if I won an Oscar and I had to do rapid fire shout outs, it would probably be three people. My mother, uh, my sister Sandy and Mother May. Those have been my three female, like rock star role models in my life. So. Those would be my three thank yous. <laughs>